to my channel hi so um, we just wanted to quickly hop on the tube and share with you some of the items that we've been loving recently yes these are like the newish additions that we really think have made a difference for us in our lives and our beauty journey okay so I want to start off <coughs> so the first thing I want to mention <coughs> sort of work. So the first thing Go now, I'm ready. So the first thing I wanted to mention was a body scrub and this is by a new brand that I really got into this summer. It's called Beauty and Planet. Um, and this smell is absolutely to die for. And this is the rose scent. Um, it's pink, the pink label, and it smells so good. If I'm gonna shave my legs or if I'm self tanning, um, I will definitely use this or if I just like feel extra dirty crazy um, I use this just to get a good all-over deep clean and I feel like it's it's pretty hydrating too which I like but the smell oh guys I wish you could smell it <laughs> um, okay so that's my first body product what about you okay my first thing that I've been using for a while now is this bad mama jamma it's a big mama jamma Coconut oil, baby. <laughs> Basically, I just use it to take off my makeup. I just dink my hand in, dink it in, dink it, and take a little like a dollop. Yeah, a scooper, a scooper, a quarter size amount. Rub it in my fingers with water and rub it on my face, and literally everything comes off. Everything. So use as a makeup remover. Yes, it's a makeup remover, and it gets off even like waterproof mascara so easily. It literally takes off everything in two seconds. And it's so gentle, it doesn't irritate my eyes or anything. I've just really been loving it. And then after I go in with um, a face wash. Do you find it like clogs your pores though? No, I do not. Love it. Sometimes I actually, I use that as like an in shower body moisturizer as well. So like after I would use the scrub or shave my legs, um, I go in with the coconut oil just once over with a light rinse. And I, and I come out feeling very like greased up. Very nice. Sticking to the shower theme, my next product um, is something that we actually both use because it is in our communal shower. Is this Method Body Wash with the scent Coconut Rice Milk Shea Butter, and it's the Simply Nourishing line. I've never, we never saw this, but we found this at Target recently. Yeah, it just um, smells good. So the smell again. So one of the biggest things I look for in like shower <laughs> products is the scent of them because I feel like the shower is an experience, baby. It is. It's like a. It's like a I was gonna say it's spa, but this is, it's coconut. It's like very sweet. So next for me, after I do the coconut oil, I really I go in with a face wash. But recently, I've been into Proactive again. I used this like a couple years ago, and then my skin was looking really gross, so then I picked it up again. And I'm almost done with it, and I like it, and it just gets the job done. It's a nice exfoliator, and I use it every day, twice a day. That's really all there is to say about that. So oh, the next product, <laughs> if we're gonna go jump into skincare, um, I actually kind of use this as a like a duo um, slash like my entire skincare routine right now is by this brand Eminence, um, which is a totally organic. I think it's European um, skincare line. The facials I use at home primarily uses this, this brand, line. this line. Yes, this line of skincare, line. and they're supposed to be really pure good. and good for your skin. Um, so one of the things I look for when I'm buying a product, maybe at Sephora or the drugstore, is the list of ingredients, <laughs> because most of the time they have a lot of chemicals in them, and like I don't necessarily want to be putting that on my body or in my, in my, in my body. Plus, it's more you. I have the Red Current Protective Moisturizer with SPF 30. Um, it's Red Current, so all of this is like naturally derived ingredients, and have like a specific thing for your face, a specific benefit. <laughs> for your face um, and I, I really love the way that this makes my skin feel 
it's definitely very thick. Just it, it kind of feels like tingly and it smells really fresh and good. Um, and it has that SPF 30, which is really great for everyday use. And then, so I've been kind of using this with a drop of the facial recovery oil by Eminence as well. At night, I like to do two to three drops. Um, and that's actually what it directs on the back here. It says two to three, two to three drops to the face and neck. Um, and I just really like to rub that in. I find it helpful if my face is a little bit damp when I'm using this, um, just to get like that even application. Exactly. My facialist was like, this is one of the best products um, for your skin, and my skin's really dehydrated right now. Facial recovery oil by Eminence, I would say absolutely must have um, if you're struggling with dry skin this season. So sticking to the theme of moisturizers, I have really been into this fresh one, the Vitamin Nectar, one that we talked about in the haul a while ago, and it's also, I use this mainly in the morning, and then I use like a facial oil at night, but like, we'll talk about that another time, you know? But I just really like how thick it is, and you only need a little bit, and it like really spreads on everywhere, thick and nice, and then like, it takes a minute to set in. But I just feel like it's really heavily hydrating, and I just really like the smell of it, and I don't know, I like how it's like glass, and it like feels nice, you know? Just like good packaging. Yeah. And you haven't broken out anything from it? No, and I've had it for a while, and I've only used like, a little bit if you can see so sticking with the skincare um genre um i guess i wanted to go into my micro derma bleeding i don't think it's that let's go oh it's it. derma rolling what is derma called? roller micro needle derma ro derma roller micro needle roller and i got the 0.25 millimeter i think that refers to how long the needles are so you can either get longer ones or shorter ones, the link will be down below, and it's on Amazon, it was literally like 12 bucks, um, and as you can see, it has a really nice grip on it, and the needles are here. So. Yeah, how often do you do that, Gabriel? Honestly, like, it would be better if I was more regimented about it, but um, I probably do this at least once a week, if not at least like once every two weeks. The best time to do this is before you're going to bed, and I would do it probably with something like the Eminence Recovery Oil. Like I put it on before, rub it in, and then I put another layer on because I'm like, spa time, girly. So this thing is really cool, and you kind of get to like have an at-home facial. I know that some some facialists actually do implement that into their um, services, but why not do it at home for 12 bucks, you know? And we actually all have been doing it and see really great results with that. We've really been into the Saint Tropez bronzing mousse. It's just the classic version that you sleep in overnight. And we've really been loving applying it with the Loving Tan Mitt because it's just better quality, we feel, than the Saint Tropez Mitt. Like, this one is good, it's fine, it just it feels a little cheap. It's and honestly, thin. I think this one's like the same price. Also, I feel like this one, sometimes if I'm using it, um, I find that my palm actually gets like it's too thin. residue. Yeah. A foam material, I don't know if you can see that. Very foam material, and this one is like felt. It's like higher quality, I just feel like it's just better. And you can wash this one, too. So it lasts longer. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what the price of it is, we'll link it down below. But these two are a winner. Are a winner. Too Faced Hangover RX Primer with coconut water, probiotic based ingredients, and skin revivers is one of my favorites. This is the sample size, and there's a reason I bought this. this what is the reason? I'll tell, tell me. You tell you the reason. So this is a perfect size for traveling and a perfect size um, if you're only really using it like for special occasions or on the weekends, which is exactly what I use it for. And my makeup space is really only so big. This is just like a perfect size, just tuck in the back. It's also a lot cheaper than the full size, um, so you can Great. feel good about that. Love it. Gotta get it. Because I feel like most primaries you're like kind of like you don't feel good about using this one it is like I feel good about using because it's supposed to be good for my skin. Moving on. So my next fall favorite is this new perfume that I recently picked up from Anthropology. It's just the vanilla scent. And I got it in the larger container, but it's literally only $18, so it's not that much. And the scent is so strong that you literally need one pop. Like that's literally it. Otherwise you will literally give yourself a headache. But yeah, I just take one squirt on the neck or one squirt and it lasts literally all day and I can smell it forever and it smells so warm so yummy so fall yes vanilla 
It reminds me of like it's a caramel leaking, okay. latte or something. All right, maybe not caramel, just like warm. It's very and, like, sweet. Sweet. It's great. It's very like good. It. Highly recommend. Go pick it up at your nearest Anthropology. Bang bang. Um, so this is actually kind of random. I'm not gonna lie to you. And it's a vitamin. And this is Quantum Health Super Life Lysine Plus. This is Quantum Health Super Lysine Plus, and it's um, immune support. Immune support. So if you're like me, um, I am constantly sick in the winter. Like I have a runny nose, have a like cough. You can probably hear in my voice right now. Um, and I really think that this helps. I take two of these a day. It's a fail. And it's super smooth, goes down really, really great. Maybe I'll pop one now. I haven't taken it today. I'd look into it if I were you, but you know, I don't have to. So, so this next product is this deodorant. It's by the brand Native. I'll link it down below. But um, in the past, I'd always use the Old Spice deodorants, but those are really, really bad for you because aluminum actually causes breast cancer and we don't want that so recently i switched over to this brand and it's paraben free and aluminum free and i've been getting the coconut and vanilla scent because i heard this was the best but they do have other scents i just haven't tried them but yeah i really like it it actually works like i'd always use old spice because i felt like not like the women's urine didn't work and like only like men's urine did and like so i was like ooh, gotta get old spice and like use that for literally years, but aluminum is literally so bad for you. So now I've switched over to this one and it really truly does work. And I even wear it to the gym and it works. Gym proof. Maybe I should pick up, pick up some of that. So yeah, and also they do sell it in Target now. I just recent, recently noticed that. It used to be only online, but now it's in stores in Target. So it's on the up and up. Yeah, people people understand aluminum is bad for your arm pennies. Okay, so my last product is actually something you're going to be like, really? This is your favorite? I think it's the majority of America's favorite, but there's a reason I'm mentioning it. So I, this school season, I bought a MacBook Pro, and they had that promotion where you got a free pair of Beats with it, so I picked up um, the Over the Ear. Really, Gabby? That's your favorite? That's all of America's favorite. Really, Gabby? Really? <laughs> so, this is the blue pair, Over the Ear, Beats. I like that they're secure when I'm working out. I like the color a lot. Honestly, these are the best pair of headphones I have, wireless headphones I've tried, and I've tried multiple pairs. Before I had this pair, I was using a pair from Amazon that was uh, Optum, I think it was Optium, the brand. I'll link it down below as a perfect dupe for these because honestly, like they're pretty solid headphones. Um, I do have to say that the battery life for these are better, but if you don't want to spend 100 plus dollars on Beats, those are like, I think like 20, 17, uh, 20, $17, $20, something in that range. range. So our 15th and final fall favorite product is this bad boy right here. And I was like, oh, I'm going to add that on my list. She was like, no, I already added that. It's on both of our lists for sharing them. And it is the Moroccan oil dry shampoo. We have the dark tones version, but they do come in a light tones. I would recommend pretty much, unless you're literally a platinum blonde, um, Close I mean, to white honestly, hair. it's like not even. It's like, not like here. Show the tip of it. Like it looks, like it's not even like brown brown. It's kind of like, like a light brown. Like this, like I'm like dark and like this is not dark. Yeah. But, but if you get any lighter, you're gonna have dust. You really like the dust. smell too, and it's just like a nice dry shampoo. You just, shh, shh, it, it, and you're good to go. And it also adds a lot of volume, which is nice, and. It doesn't leave yeah. any residue, so like if I'm going through my hair like this, I can't necessarily tell that I use that stuff, but it smells bomb. Like, I love the smell of that. Um, pretty much all the Moroccan products are pretty great, but honestly, like if you're going to spend $28 on a dry shampoo, That's Moroccan the one. oil, do it. Do dark it. Dark shampoo. Do Wait, it now. Dark tones. Get it. Right now. Mm. So this is our fall favorites haul. Hopefully you guys found something new that you can add to your lifestyle. How many of you out there have a cabinet full of products you've tried and eh, disregarded? These are products that we continually go back to and that we will go back to and I think that's worth the money spent. The, the holy grail yes. of our product. And even though this is titled a fall favorites, because yeah, fall time is a great time to get in your beauty game. Trying out new shit and really getting, getting your glow up on. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. That's all for Fall Favorites. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. In the